and uh, we are working with the B component route, so we have a cementitious uh, component A and we have an activator and the component B. These two uh, components are only mixed in the injection nozzle, um, so behind the tail shield and uh, this mix is routed into the, into the annular gap where it uh, sets very quickly, um, it jellifies and stabilizes the ring immediately. So there is no pea gravel? There's no pea gravel. There's no pea gravel on this project. I would say pea gravel belongs to the past. Um, also, the huge uh, logistic uh, challenge that is related to pea gravel. Um, uh, no, no, we are applying here the most modern uh, technology. But that is a large annular gap, no? It's a large uh, annular gap, but we have also equipped this machine with the uh, required uh, pumping system for doing this. Yeah. But that's a, a large expense also. Uh, it is a large expense, but it will work out uh, and pay out again uh, in, a, in an improved uh, efficiency. Another, another uh, aspect of the B component routing is that we uh, are pumping the two components from the surface to the TBM, so we have no uh, need for an additional logistical uh, wheel driven uh, system. So you will pump both from the surface? Yes. That's a long way as you're getting to, towards the end there. It's a long way, but it's also a long uh, or a good saving on uh, on driving. So I think uh, this is the right decision and we will make it. So it will pump into reservoirs on the back? Exactly. Yeah.